Hello, welcome to another English class. And for this opportunity, we have indirect questions, WH question, using simple present. We're going to learn indirect question, how to make them using WH question, but in the simple present. The simple present form. The definition says we use it to make a question more polite. This is the structure. We've been using this structure, but in this opportunity, it will change something. Take a look what part of the structure changes. We use do plus subject, plus verb, we're still using the verb no, after that, we add a new friend. This is WH. Remember in WH, for we have different, we have where, we have why, we have what, and some others. So in this part, it goes the WH for. After that, the subject, the verb, but it have to be in a simple present. Then the complement and plus the question mark. Same is for the second structure, but using the auxiliarity can and could. Can, could, subject plus verb. You can use tell me or explain. It will be up to you if you use either one or the other one. Okay, then you have to use WH for. You can use any WH for. Then the subject plus verb, be careful, it has to be in the simple present, and then the complement and the question mark. Let's take a look at the first example. It says, hey, do you know why? Why? My friend is in the library this morning. It's a long question. Let's repeat that question again. Hey, do you know why? My friend is in the library this morning. That is the indirect question, more politely for. But if you want to know how to ask this question, but in the direct form or in the normal way, you can ask, hey, why is my friend in the library this morning? Why is my friend in the library this morning? But this is the formal way. The more casual form, you can ask someone. But an indirect question, remember, is only if you want to be more polite. Okay, let's take a look at the second sentence. Now using the auxiliarity can. Can you tell me? Or you can also use can you explain? Okay. Then you use another WA question. And this opportunity we're using what? Okay, let's read it. Hey, can you tell me what Maria cooks for lunch? That is the question. But how you can ask if you want to use a direct question? Hey, what does Maria cook for lunch? That would be normal. But I want you to learn how to ask an indirect question for. Can you tell me what Maria cooks for lunch? Remember, this is the simple verb form is, which is the verb to be. And then take a look. This is the verb. In this sentence, is cooks. Okay. okay, that will be all for this class. So see you in the next one. Bye.